It's gonna be right, going by off, the guys. Let's go, Joe. Wait, seriously? Speaking of Joe, I just uh, watched a pretty good um, show um, lately. Hey, hey, hey! How's it going? It's cool. Oh, well. Have you seen Mega Low Box? I've seen snippets. It's pretty good. I just watched. I really enjoyed it. I've heard it's amazing. I would give it an eight point three five out of ten. Definitely worth yeah. the watch. I, I really don't watch anime anymore, but I've watched a few episodes. Yes. But the problem is I don't have really much time these days. Understandable. Like Thursday is my only real day off. Well, I'm glad to see you here, though. Yeah. I love you guys. Love you too, baby. <laughs> I love you too. <laughs> <laughs> very handsome. Very slag. But we've got Sheik versus Diddy. What do you think about this match? What's your initial problem? You've seen a lot. I have too. Um, I'm here your take. The main problem is she has to keep Diddy out. That's her kind of her thing, the entire thing. That's her entire gimmick, rather. Yes. If, for lack of a better term. But it's Diddy. So she has to keep on the pressure. I don't want to stage. Yeah. I don't want to say it's easier for Diddy to approach because she has very good approach options, but it's simpler for Diddy. It's like he throws out this big fair that will beat a lot of Sheik's moves, especially with the nerf now. Exactly. All day Sheik fair, I'm sure did better against it than it does. I'm pretty sure it loses now. Well, I mean, it went farther than Marth's sword. Oh yeah. Oh god. Let's not think about that. <laughs> let's, let's not think about that pre patch. Uh, uh, shivers. Uh, <laughs> Yowza. But no, Diddy fair is a great tool in this match. She really can't challenge it very well, and if she does, she she trades, and that's not what she wants, because then she, she dies. Uh-huh. She dies very hard. Oh, God. And now I'm so clean with getting those double jump up airs. Those things scare me. Every time oh, yeah. I see someone jumping up high, they're like, ah, I'm safe. I'm going up high. I'm like, no, I guess not. You're not. <laughs> oh, going to cross up the, that DI? The, the main problem I see with Diddy players in general is that Monkey Flip loses games, and he almost Monkey Flips straight into his Sheik up air in the blast zone. Good down to the up air. That was a read on the jump. Mm -hmm. And again, I feel like it's like a lot of moves in this game. It's so good, but because it's so good, you keep on wanting to use it as like a crux to get yeah. out of bad situations. Yeah. And then when you become reliant on it, that's when it becomes hella grab, and that's when you lose your stack, oh, despite yeah. it being an amazing move. It's an amazing move. It's like it's a 50-50 command grab hitbox. But, but, I mean, if you just do oh, it in the God. wrong spot, get out of there. <laughs> he didn't get out of there. He just air dodged right into there. It was not true. Up, up throw up air. It was not true at that percent. Mm -hmm. But with the air dodge weight, yeah. Okay, banana, banana. I like it. It's, it's pretty, pretty good neutral tool. You just press down B and you get half the stage for free. <laughs> and the thing is, it's like you can use it as a throwing item. You can just hold it on stage and do nothing with it. Yeah, and just exert pressure. Like, yeah. what are you gonna do about it? You what, know? Are you, what are you gonna do about this fruit? And I also feel like Diddy, as a character, uses been he's got a good item throw data. Absolutely. You know, a lot of characters have dog, poo poo, <laughs> like um, Little Mac, and like, Ness. <laughs> he's like, I'm just gonna wind up. Uh, I got a glove, so I can't throw it. I remember for a while, Diddy players were telling me, "Yeah, you need to hold banana." And I was talking to James about. It, he's like, "You definitely, I want Ness to hold banana." And that's what I got scared about the match a bit more. Ooh, now I'm going in deep, trying to give Diddy, but not getting anything out of it. And I like how because. Nanaba as a player, once he gets started, he's very good at rinse repeating, just kind of diddy vortex, just re grabbing, getting damage, catching your landing. But the way that Nam is trying to uh, put pressure on and just seal the game, I think that's smart against a player like Nanaba. At the same time, Nam plays Zenodo a lot, so right. I would assume he's well versed in this matchup. He doesn't like it, but he is well versed in it. Yes, Who likes I agree. fighting Diddy, though? That's kind of the thing. Who likes fighting Sheik? Probably more people. <laughs> um, I play Ryu, I play Ryu, fam. I love it. Oh, they're at 40. I'm going to mash up till. There you go. And I like that um, air dodge weight bear because a lot of players, a lot of less experienced Sheiks, would have just waited and tried to, like, bounce a fish there. But now I'm just kind of recognizing the situation, recognizing that DI Diddy is DIing in, and just kind of bear him for air dodging. You didn't need to throw a bouncing fish at that percent anyway. There was no point. Yeah. You what? don't want to air dodge into death. Yeah. You want to air dodge away from death in that kind of situation, in my right. opinion. But it's tough when it's you're at 130. You guys, so. You're like, oh, I'm hanging on by a third. Oh, no, I'm not even I mean, she can kill you with like eight different moves at that point. Yeah. That deep, you know? Yeah, when you're that deep. Hello? 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 <laughs> We're not tripping. Nam grabbed him over the banana and then tripped at the banana. Yeah. That's probably my least favorite thing about Diddy. It's like, I feel like all the Ds are like, yeah, it was totally intentional, man. Yeah, no, it wasn't. I you wanted you to grab me, and it's like, come on, man. No, not every didn't. banana that accidentally slips on me after you grabbed me was intentional. Maybe a third of them are. Come on, be <laughs> honest, though. You're not a Robin player. You're not that smart. <laughs> You're not two steps ahead. Come on. Well, Diddy's played one step ahead, while Robin's three steps ahead. Mm -hmm. There you go. I love these bears and nares. 
It's gonna be <laughs> saying, "Hey, you're down there. I'm up here. You stay down there." Yeah, and I don't even think he could have done like the patented Zenodo quick barrel thing. I so, like Nam was just putting so much quick pressure in a row that I don't think he could have done it. It was like he wasn't given enough time for it. Not even. I don't even think I had a jump at that point. Yeah, so it didn't matter. Yeah, that's true. Exactly. And now, um, you have to bring this back a little bit. Putting him in a Diddy Vortex, but if, if you can't take the stock, you know, what's the point? But I really like the way that Nam is trying to dance around Diddy, which you have to do. Because, I mean, Diddy has so many options in neutral. That's, that's it. Did it kill? Wow. <laughs> oh, yeah. no. He never got a jump feels, back. That's like a big feels, man. Like, feels bad, man, yeah. when, like, you don't know where you jump when you just die for yeah, it. Yeah, like, oh, 